Danny, we said before uh, Saturday that with naught points on the board that things could be looking very different and they really are six points over Bank Holiday weekend. You must be delighted with that today. Yeah, I really, uh, really am. It was, uh, it really showed two sides to us, didn't it? The first half, we were really good. We played some fantastic football. A uh, great header from Jack Birchall gave us the lead. Uh, and I felt perhaps we should have gone in leading by more than the one goal, but we didn't. And then the second half, it was real, you know, down the bottom, uh, Tom Bridge. It was real backs to the wall, wasn't it? And we defended like real men, uh, superbly backed up by our goalkeeper Ben Winterbottom and uh, yeah no a very very good day very very good bank holiday weekend Ollie let's put it that way absolutely and uh, obviously the it's a, it's a one goal win uh, but a clean sheet I mean how important is that to you just as much as, as the goals we're scoring at the other end but to keep a clean sheet so I think it's the first of the season it's just important it shows how important it is to get the points today 100% I mean you know this is a really tough base to come uh, I don't think I've ever won here as a manager before I certainly didn't at the previous club but you know we've come here and I think we were worthy winners uh, um, but it's a real tough place. Not many places. You know, Jay's, Jay's one of the best managers in the league. They've got a great setup here. They've got you know some really good players, uh, one or two of our former players as well. So yeah, it's it's not easy. But I'm delighted to get three points. The goals have been spread around the team. I think it was mentioned to you a minute ago that all different goal scorers so far this season. Jack Birchall getting the winner today. Someone you've shown a lot of faith in. Someone that you, you knew about having having at your previous club as well. So how pleased are you for him to to, to put in at both ends defending brilliantly and, and then scoring a winner? Well, I thought you know for him to. I don't think he's ever, ever even scored in training before. Um, so for him to score the winner in a you know a Kent derby or you know is really crucial, isn't it? But yeah, I thought he was you know he's he apart from that first game which we try not to mention, he's been really good for us as his big uh, Locky. I think he's every game he's looking better and better. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's not about. But I've, I just said to, to the players in the change room, it's not about individuals. I must say the boys who didn't get selected today, you know Kareem, Ayo, they're here backing us up. We've obviously you know to feed and Cameron Andrews didn't get on the pitch. It's about the whole group, Ollie. It's not about individuals. And that's why, hopefully, you know, we do OK. I know you're still looking to have little tweaks, maybe just to finesse the squad a little bit. We were talking about that striker last week. Um, some other bodies you're having a look at, at this week as well, you've mentioned. Um, so this is kind of is just a start, isn't it, of, of, of what we want to want to look at and what we want to go in through the season with. It does feel like that, doesn't it, to be honest with you? You know, you're around the club like I am. You, see, you know, I remember your interview last week when you said about the boys in good spirits. Well... You know, we couldn't even hear the interview. The boys are certainly in good spirits. They're a good bunch, aren't they? And they're a good bunch, um, I was saying to one of the previous interviews, they're a good bunch, aren't they? I think what people have realised, they really care about the club and, you know, the interaction with the fans. That's always been me, and it's something I really like. And I think the fans are just amazing, aren't they? How they're really getting behind us, and uh, they seem to be enjoying it, and I'm always, I, I always enjoy it. I say, speaking of a good bunch, we had a, a great crowd behind us, as we always do, behind the goal today. And then, obviously, we've put the video out already so the fans have seen it but you getting really involved high-fiving them all and leading and up the wings there um, they loved it you loved it and that's really great to see how important is that bond well, for you it's, it's important for how I am you know other managers might be different but it's their football club isn't it you know we're just custodians I'm the manager at the moment uh, hopefully that's for a long time but uh, you know it's their club I want to give to them uh, and I'm certainly, you know, my players do. I love it when the players go and thank them all afterwards. And they've been there when we've lost as well, haven't they? They was at that game when we conceded in the 100th minute against Chelmsford, the penalty against Hemel. You know, you can go on. But I've also, one thing I would like to mention today is the quality of the referee. Stephen Hughes, in my opinion, is without a shadow of doubt the best referee in this league. And you're going away from a game, not even thinking about the ref. He's, he's, he's just a different level. Um, so really well done to him. Many, you know, hopefully, you know, we wish Jay uh, Parkey and Lloyd Blackman the Tombridge boys well as well um, and that'd, that'd be okay they're a good side let's not make no mistake about this and as I said this is a really tough place to come uh, I've never done it before and get three points just finally it's six points obviously over the last three days loads of games coming up now we've got Saturdays Tuesdays Saturdays uh, as, as ever in this league it's, it's a bit relentless but how much of a platform does that provide now for the next next month going into a, a new month well, September? I've said all along my first target and I said this at the previous club and other people say they want this they want that my first target is to get 44 points let's say that's 15 wins isn't it you know 45 even you know three times 15 is 45 Ollie. even you can work that out um, <laughs> so we, we, we need now we need another 13 wins once we've got that as soon as we can get that we can have a a bit of fun can't we and, and enjoy the season and that's that's how I've always worked some people don't like that think that's being unambitious I don't I think it's being sensible well done Danny cheers thank you very much indeed <laughs>